Hi, I'm Belinda and today I'm going to show you how to create a vitamin C serum formula using the Create Cosmetic Formulas program. First, log in and select the serum gel-like formula. Now in this formula, I want vitamin C to be the main focus. So I'm going to go straight to my actives and select a stable form of vitamin C. I'm going to pick the sodium ascorbyl phosphate. And I want to use this at the maximum recommended input because this is the main active from my formulation. I'm going to add a few added extras just to boost my marketing story. So I'm going to pick a few natural Australian extracts rich in vitamin C, such as Davidson plum, kakadu plum, and lily pilly extracts. I'm only going to use small amounts of these in my formula because the main active that's providing all of the efficacy is that vitamin C. Next I'm going to pick my humectant and because I want a nice low tacky formula but still humectant C I'm going to be using some propane diol. And I'm going to add this at the maximum recommended input of 10%. Now I need a gum to help gel this product. I'm going to pick hydroxyethyl cellulose because this will have a good viscosity build and stabilizing effect. And I'm going to input this at 1.5% to build a nice viscosity to the product. Next I'm going to pick a really light skin fill lipid. And for this I'm going to just select cocoa caprylate because this is going to add some emolliency to the formula but no greasy afterfill. I'm aiming to create a really light serum here. So I'm only going to input this at 2%. I'm going to pick some essential oils now and I only want a really light aroma out of this product. So I'm going to pick some bergamot, some geranium and some rosewood. And I'm only going to use some really small amounts in the formula. I don't want the scent to be too overpowering. I just want it there present in the background. Next, I'm going to pick my antioxidant. And to help stabilize my formula, I'm going to use this at the maximum recommended input of 0.5%. Now I'm going to select my preservative. I'm going to use a really tried and tested preservative to make sure it's got good preservative function throughout the shelf life. I'm going to be using the GeoGuard ECT and because it's a nutrient rich formula I'm going to use this at the maximum recommended input of 1%. Now I can generate my method. And here is my formula and my method. It's time to head into the lab.
and that's how you can create your own vitamin C serums. You could also create vitamin C serums that are a bit more lotion-like or even vitamin C creams with the Create Cosmetic Formulas program. The choice is yours. Please give the video a thumbs up. Please leave any questions or comments below and make sure to subscribe to createcosmeticformulas.com so you can get creating your own vitamin C products. Happy formulating.